So, we are finally wrapping the rear bumper. I decided to remove the tail lights so I could tuck it up inside of there, kind of doctor these edges from the last time I was in here. And yeah, this is the before shot. Fail. I should probably do a little time lapse and then I'll give you a rundown at the very end. So, let's get to it. So what you're seeing here is how not to start. I started from one end and kind of worked my way towards the middle, hoping that I could just lay it from one side to the next. And it worked out just fine up until we got over some weird curvatures of the bumper. The next time I try this, I think definitely I'm going to do it inside. So I've got control of the temperature around the wrap, the temperature of the wrap, and I also learned that I probably should have laid the wrap across the span of the bumper rather than trying to start from one end and working the rest of the film off of the backing. So a little update on uh, where we're at right now in the process. And if you ask me, I'd say she is definitely coming together. No more silver bumper, baby. Let's go. Disregard all of this. So, as you guys probably read in the description and um, seen in the video, this was my first time wrapping, and this is not how you would go about wrapping a bumper. Uh, we got her done though, so we will flash forward to that right after this. I forgot to set up the camera, forgot slash didn't want to <laughs> set up the camera for the next day that we started working on it after we ran out of daylight because I had uh, some weird bubbling that I just could not get out of it. And so I wound up actually having to cut it in one, two, three different locations and just overlay it and call a gravy because it's a drift car so send it right bro <laughs> well your boy done did it we got to fully purple z well black and purple but fully purple z what is good we gonna fix that too but don't worry about that this should look fire <laughs> So with that, we will flash forward to the other day whenever I got it finished up and took it to the car wash. Well, thanks guys for sticking around and tuning in on how to not wrap your rear bumper. But yeah, we got her done and hopefully we'll see you on the next one. I've got an A pillar that I need to redo and maybe gonna touch up some other stuff. So stay tuned guys, catch you next time. Peace.